we're in Fort Lauderdale in Las Olas Art Fair, and I just met a beautiful um, artist from Washington, from uh, Washington? Uh, Washington, Massachusetts. Washington, Massachusetts. I always have a problem pronouncing that. Yeah. <laughs> And you can see his art here is very beautiful, made out of metal, and each piece takes him um, pretty much really long time to make. Um, anywhere from like I guess a couple of weeks to a couple of uh, uh, to, to a year to a year or a couple of years. A couple of years. This one is gorgeous. This one is an Indian, and we have one here that's a standing Indian. I'm going to show them, and then we can talk about it. This is the standing Indian one. It's pretty, like how tall is he? He's taller than me. He's a little over six feet. He's, six, about, uh, he's about six two. He's six foot tall, huh? Six foot two, and he's made of steel, brass, copper, and bronze. Uh, I created him uh, using one rod, welding rod at a time. One welding rod one at a time. One rod, rod wow. at a time, and I create from my vision. Mm -hmm. He's, uh, uh, I take one rod, weld it in place, mm -hmm. and heat the, the metal every speck of the way while I'm forming it with my left wow, hand. Wow, that's amazing. And I create from my mind. Um, I don't do any sketching. Uh, wow. my, my work is my own. Wow. Uh, that I started um, uh, developing about 51 years ago. 51 years in doing this and going. God yeah. bless your soul. Yeah, but I can still see. <laughs> <laughs> Love the Indian. And you are part Indian, right? Uh, well, about 16th Comanche. 16th Comanche. Well, how do you say um, um, <coughs> nice meeting you in Indian? Is there another way to shake I, and say? Uh, <laughs> I, uh, <laughs> how? How? Oh, no. Oh, no, brown cow. Take care. <laughs> Thank 